Hello, this is a new video series I'm going to be doing for the next couple of weeks just to see if it works or not. So it is a beta version of the thing that I want to do going forward. Uh, as you can see I'm back on Final Fantasy XIV. Uh, I took a long break from it because of my speed runs I was doing. They weren't, they weren't doing too well. I don't think people liked that content on the channel either. So I do, you know, it is what it is. No, I, I don't want to speedrun that game anymore. But uh, I'm doing something different, and that is how to make guild guides. Uh, I'm going to be doing guides on making guild, how to navigate the market boards and marketplaces, whichever way you like to call it, throughout the game. Uh, and I've set the restriction of... Uh, so the challenge is, can I become the richest player in Final Fantasy XIV from just selling logs and lumber? And basically, my uh, can we call them again? Um, the, the minions who sell the stuff for you. I'm just go I have currently have three of them. Let's go over. I'll show. I'll explain it on the way to the to the spot. But basically, we're just going to be selling logs and lumber, and we're going to see if we can become the richest player in game from just selling those items. So retainers, sorry I've got. So I have three retainers currently. I don't really want to purchase. I I do buy one on a subscription every month. But I, so that's my Jill Warwick one, and you can buy more. I think you can buy up to eight retainers. But I'm gonna to stick to the three for now because it kind of do, is like wasting money. So I kind of don't want to waste money on buying extra retainers. So the challenge is to make as much skill as possible from just selling logs and lumber. Just logs and lumber throughout the game. So obviously I have to navigate the market boards, uh, obviously fear of undercuts which is happening consistently. Um, I'm undercut all the time but I also undercut, I can, I, I can admit to that. I think that is how marketplace works, that is how in a normal civilised society that, well not civilised society but in a normal societal setting people will lower their prices to gain more custom uh, it is what it is it's not the best practice ever i can admit to that myself but i'll try and stick to fair value prices and obviously uh certain logs come at higher prices but can obviously steep over time depending on what's being used consistently in the game currently so what I'm selling most of at the moment is, let's go, nope, I've made no gill today. I currently stand at 2,050, uh, 215,807. So we'll be tracking that. So that'll be our starting point from this video forward. How much can we make up to that point? So the most I am selling at the moment, this is the mishmash. There's a bit of everything being sold in logs and lumber here. All at fair price, obviously. I mean, I'm selling Ma Maple's only selling for five at the moment. Uh, just look at the prices. Yeah, it's only it's, it's low. I put it as low as two at the moment. It was high the other day, but it's been lots. Someone was selling it for a thousand because it was in demand the other day. So the demand on the board is consistently changing. But people know that a lot longer than me. Uh, I know I'm being undercut on this one right now. Yes, yeah, someone's undercut it by one gill. That's a common practice on these boards. People will just undercut you by one single gill just to sell their item. It's no surprise. Obviously, look, if you see on my comrade kit retainer, I'm selling 499s, 499s, so it's about oh, just a, a close to 500. No, it's not. That's stupid. Just under, just before 400. Elm logs. Uh, I reckon they'll go in the next couple of days. It depends if the market changes or not on the Elm logs. Um, like more high valued ones, other specific petrified logs, they go for high price. But I think that's changed now. Should be six hundred. Yeah, it's been cut to four nine nine. So I'm going to put that down to four hundred because I kind of need to get rid of that at this point. Uh, let's go to my other retainer. Obviously, comrade pick here. That retain currently is selling mainly elm, elm, sand teak logs, ironwood logs. I am selling a lot of rose. Who's selling my rosewood actually? 
Uh, I think it's my Jill Warwick character, maybe? I don't know. She's sold anything recently, though. Last sale? A few sale history? Birch Lumber, today. Sold that today. Uh, but from this point forward, we're only selling logs and lumber. That is the only thing we're doing now. And obviously, I need to change my retainer classes to botany because I'm using a botanist as well to gather uh, logs for me. And it would be more beneficial to have all three retainers as botanists consistently collecting logs when I'm not gathering logs in between. I do need ventures for that though, so I can buy some more. Um, I'm hoping this series will be. Good, it's more relaxed than my other stuff. I uh, just hope um, it gets somewhere and see how much we can make just from selling logs and lumber. It's a daft idea, but I like daft ideas and no one else is doing it, so and I think logs and lumber are the most accessible gathering items possible. It's just tedious, so you have to enjoy gathering. You really do have to enjoy gathering to enjoy this challenge, to be honest. Uh, so I'll see you in the next video. This will mainly be live streamed or weekly updates on where we're up to and how much skill we've made. I might just go for the weekly update video and just upload the streams in between. The streams will only be on the days the days I have off work though. So I won't be doing anything in between that just as a restriction on myself that I don't spend all my time just streaming the day. Um, and that'll make those weekly videos of where we're up to and Gil. So there'll also be this introduction video to the challenge and then we'll go straight into this will be classed as day one uh, at the end of the week. So next Saturday morning there should be a weekly video of where we're up to and how much we've sold. So I'll run through everything, how much we've sold that week, what's selling the most, where prices are at for logs, log and lumber. Which just fluctuate consistently. Like I'll log in tonight and all those prices will be completely all over the show. Well, I won't have time to log in tonight to see. But I guarantee by the morning it will be a different case. It will be something really different. Uh, but yeah, I hope you like this video. Uh, and I'll see you going forward. Remember to like and subscribe. No pressure, you don't have to subscribe to my channel. A lot of people don't subscribe but still watch my stuff, so I appreciate that. I don't need thousands of people, I just enjoy doing this. Thank you very much, see you later.